Okay, Shalom, Shalom, Kwam Yashallah, Ko Holo, Yahweh Bahashim Yahwesai, Bahashim Rachach Hadash, double honors to the apostles of Great Millstone that rule well, that taught us this beautiful truth by the Spirit. And just want to say the water to all the Akim and Akwap that's out here sincerely keeping the law, statutes, and commandments of Yahweh Bahashim Yahwesai to the best of their ability. Just coming at you with another quick lesson. Pray that it's edifying by the Spirit. And hey, man, hey, these so called white people. <laughs> These Edomites, hey, they really got it out for you Negroes, man. You so-called blacks, Hispanics, and Native Americans. You see? Now, the, America has this opioid problem, right? There are a lot of, you know, so-called white people, a lot more of them, you know, dying than being born. And they have a real opioid problem. You know, the same problems that we had during the crack stages. And crack is still out here, you know. But check out what this guy is doing with your taxpayers' money. Now, not, not only... Now, this guy right here, he's supposed to be a Christian. He came in, put his hands on that big ass Bible and then changed all the rules around. Now, the transgenders can go to the army and get up to a two hundred thousand dollar, you know, um, sex change operation on your taxpayer money. Now, check out what he's using your taxpayer money for. For you so-called Negroes, he, he, he wants equity for you, for you so-called blacks, Hispanics and Native Americans. It says Biden administration to fund the, dis the distribution of crack pipes and syringes to promote racial equity. This is how much this is how much this this dude love you. This is how much this dude love you, so-called blacks, Hispanics, and Native Americans, that he's gonna supply you the killer drug to kill your ass. All in the name of we we just want to try and keep them safe, you know. <laughs> I'm telling you, man. The so-called white man is the devil that the Bible speaks of, and you're not gonna get around it, man. This shit right here, people ought to be damn outraged, man. And matter of fact, they're spending your taxpayers' money on this. I'm trying, I'm, I'm, you know, I'm, I'm not the most righteous man. But I'm trying to live a righteous life, man. I'm trying to live these laws, statutes, and commandments of Yahweh by Shimei Awashai to the best of my ability, right? So now, here we go. Hey, hey. Here we go. This guy's using my taxpayers' money. To, 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 to promote something to kill my people, man. First off, they want to push the A, B, C, D, E, F, G shit on our people to, you know, basically say, hey, don't reproduce no more. We want to give you the rights for your sons to be girls and your, and your, your daughters to be boys. So you don't, re you, that's a form of, um, you know, genocide right there, man. Now you want to use my taxpayers' money to, 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 ki to help my people kill themselves. In the, in the name of, I'm trying to do them right. I'm trying to, you know, have racial equity for them. <laughs> and you, and you, Jake, you went out and you voted for this guy, man. You ought to be ashamed of yourselves. You, you, you so-called blacks, Hispanics, and Native Americans that ran out here in droves and was crying and was kumbaya as if this guy was your savior. This motherfucker trying to kill you, man. It says on Monday, applications closed for... The applications closed for the Biden administration new $30 million grant program to provide crack pipes and smoking kits to promote racial equity. <laughs> oh my goodness, man. Starting this May, the harm reduction program. Now, they, look at what they're calling it the harm reduction program. Don't crack cause harm to you. You promoting this shit for people to go get uh, with the taxpayers' money now. It says, starting this May, the harm reduction program will provide taxpayer funds to nonprofits and local governments that work to make drug use safer for addicts. <laughs> Overseen by the Department of Health and Human Services, the grants will be allocated towards smoking kits and supplies that will provide pipes for users to smoke crack cocaine, crystal meth, <laughs> uh, crystal meth, man, and any illicit substance. So they're providing it basically legally so Jake can just go out here and just blow his head off, man. It says the program hopes the kits will reduce the risk of infection when doing drugs with glass pipes. Is that so? It prioritizes the organizations that target, target undeserved communities. And guess who, they, guess who those undeserved communities are? Including African-Americans and LGBTQ plus persons to comply with President Biden's executive order on advancing racial equity. And you trying to tell me, man, I want to call this dude so many damn names, man. I'm just trying to, I'm going to keep it classy by the spirit, man, for real. 
this is uh, this is just this is terrible, man. Baba Kusha, Baba Kusha, Baba Kusha, why Baba Ball, man? Continue on praying for the downfall of Esau Edom's kingdom, man. This shit needs to fall, man. You trying to tell me the planet don't need new direction, <laughs> new uh, it needs new management, man. This is what your government is doing with your taxpayers' money, man. He trying to get, come on, man. For you so-called blacks, Hispanics, and Native Americans, this is what it, he has planned for you because he love you so fucking much, man. Oh, my goodness, man. We need out of here, man. It says, the purpose of the program is to support community-based overdose prevention programs, surrender service, services programs, other harm reduction services, the grant said. Funding will be used to enhance overdose and other types of prevention activities to help control the spread of infectious diseases and the consequences of such diseases for individuals with or at risk developing substance use disorders. Oh, my goodness. <laughs> there have been mixed responses to the program. Oh, yeah. From state to with some states opting out of the program. While cities like San Francisco and Seattle have started distributing the kits. Meanwhile, Republicans are blasting the program for using taxpayers' dollars to aid the drug abuse. Hey, this your boy Biden, though. No. This your boy Biden, man. So, Lockie, don't know what just happened there. Let me go back into it. This your boy Biden, though, no, man. This is who you Negroes voted for. You Negroes went out and voted for, for, for your taxpayers' money to kill your damn people, man. This is retarded as hell. How you you go to school, you get PhDs, you got all these damn letters behind and in front of your fucking name. You got a master's, you got a BA, you got a whatever that PhD. You got all these damn names, these damn letters in behind in front of your name. And this is the dumb shit that you come up with as a leader, man. Boy. Whew. Man, 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 man. <laughs> it says I'm thinking out of the empty out of the program while cities like san francisco and seattle have started distributing the kits meanwhile republicans are blasting the program for using taxpayers dollars to aid in drug abuse biden is sending free meth and crack pipes to minority communities in the name of racial equity u.s senator marco rubio florida said there is no end to the sight of this lunacy and he's right but where are the so-called negro leaders where is al sharpton at where's reverend jesse jackson at man Where's um, uh, Benjamin Crump, the motherfucker that is, that's always popping up uh, uh, when, when, when some nigga gets shot by a police officer? Where is he at? Where are all these so-called black leaders, man, that, that, that supposedly... Where is BLM? Tell me where the hell is Black Lives Matter, man. Where are these people at? And this is why I say all the time, too, man, repent to you. How about Shimi Abba for sins, you know, unknowingly being, you know, committed. You know what I'm saying? Because... Our taxpayers' money is being used in this type of sin, man. This is corruption. This is this is, the scripture says, love the, the good and hate the evil. This is fucking evil as hell. They're using my hard earned money that, first off, they're thieving and taking from me before I can even see it to do shit that I don't agree with. That's why we should be exempt. And then they'll tell you, you free. You start to tell you so-called Negroes that you're free when, when really in reality, you're some of the biggest tributaries in this place, man. They're taking your damn money and using it against your people to kill them, man. It says last week, Biden talked about being tough on crime. Tom Cotton, Republican. And see, this is what I'm saying, man. Hey, look, I don't vote. But if I voted, I would never vote for no goddamn Democrat. Them some of the dumbest fucking people in the world. Because they allow this type of stuff. They're the ones that, that push this kind of stuff, man. It says, this week, the Biden administration announced funds for crack pipe dis 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 distribution to advance racial equity. President Biden's son, Hunter Biden, has openly admitted to using crack. Yeah, get that shit to him. <laughs> Some critics argue the new program reflects the president's sympathy towards drug abuse because of his son. Man, fuck his son. He was out here doing porn and crack, <laughs> smoking crack and porn shows. <laughs> hey, that's that's him. Give it, let him do it. It says funding for the grant program is provided through the American Rescue Plan and will last three years and include 25 awards of up to four hundred thousand dollars. And you already know who's going to get those grants. White people, so-called white people. Those are the ones that are going to get those grants. And they will be they'll be happy to push that shit on you on you so-called Negroes, man. But anyway, let's grab some scripture. Boy, I tell you, man. And this is the reason why <laughs> this is the reason why this scripture comes out so much. And then these bastards, they'll never mind, man.
Oh boy. Salakia, 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 man. This shit just. Matter of fact, let me just <laughs> let me just get to a, let me <laughs> Man, yo, it's gotta be so so damn heated, man. Ecclesiasticus, Ecclesiastes 7 and 7. Surely oppression maketh the wise man mad. And a gift destroyeth the heart, man. You see? As a matter of fact, hey, I mean, <laughs> just from this wisdom that Yahweh by Shimmy Shai, man, has, has given me over the years, this shit just pissed me the hell off. And then you, we can go on further into this scripture and a gift destroyeth the heart. This is supposedly be a gift to you niggas, and it's going to destroy you. You see? This is supposedly a gift from your president that he loved you so much. This motherfucker tried to get you to roll your goddamn sleeve up. That didn't work the way that he wanted it to work. Now all of a sudden, he wants you to, he, 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 he's, pu he's pushing crack in your damn hood, man. Boy, I'm telling you, man. Hey, another one of these presidents that you Negroes and went out here and voted for that has done nothing for you. This is, this is a branch off of, uh, of your boy Ob Obama. This motherfucker was with Obama eight years and didn't do shit for you. <laughs> oh, my goodness, man. Job 9 and 24. Let me keep it classy as I can, man. This boy, I tell you. The earth is given into the hand of the wicked. He covered the faces of the judges thereof. If not, where and who is he? You see? He, they, can't get around it, man. The E is, is just wicked as all hell. They are wicked as hell. Earth need new management. This is what happens, man, when, when you got goddamn um, um, vile-ass people running the planet, man. Here you go. They, 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 this is supposed to be a gift to you. They love you so much that they're going to provide you with shit to kill you. You know how stupid this? Oh, my goodness, man. Boy, we need out of here, man. We need out of here, man. Let me get one more. <laughs> we need out of here. Ezekiel 35 and 5. Oh, my. Because Esau got that perpetual hatred for you niggas. And y'all don't seem to see it. Ezekiel 35 and 5. Because thou hast had a perpetual hatred and hast shed the blood of the children of Israel by the force of the sword in the time of their calamity and the time that their iniquity had in them. Therefore, as I live, saith the Lord. <laughs> Therefore, as I live, saith the Lord God, I will prepare thee unto blood and blood shall pursue thee since thou hast not hated blood. Even blood shall pursue thee. And that goes for you so-called white people, man. You have been so treacherous towards the children of Israel, man, as a people, man. This shit right here is a perfect example. You can't get no more hatred than, than some shit like this. And, 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 and I'll wrap the words. Let's, let's, get the, let's get the title of this program again. The Harm Reduction Program. <laughs> Isn't that like an oxymoron? Nigga, don't crack harm you. Don't, don't meth harm you. And then it's for any drugs. They basically saying, hey, go ahead. Legally, knock yourself out. Go ahead, man. You can do it. Let me provide it for you. You know why? Because we're falling behind in these birth rates from, from our people dying off opioids. We need to just even the playing field. Let's just even the score. <laughs> hey, any state, if your state take funds for this, they, they wicked as hell, man. And it don't make no difference. It's all of America. All of America is wicked. Any kingdom that Esau or Edom runs is wicked as hell, man. These people are incapable of being righteous, man. This is the perfect example of it. This is a perfect example. <laughs> man, you know what? I'm, I'm just going to end out there, man. I'm, I'm, you know, just try and keep it, like I said again, as classy as I can, man. Because this got me wanting to say all kinds of stuff, man. For real. I can't even believe it, man. This guy is using our taxpayers' money to kill our own people, man. Incredible. Incredible. And you know what? This kind of remind me of um when um they had that program, well, with Planned Parenthood. You know, with Planned Parenthood, Planned Parenthood take donations. And when they take those donations, a person can say, hey, I would like to donate this towards a so-called black mom getting an abortion. You can, you can put it towards any race you want to. And, and, and they, they had so-called white men and so-called white women that were donating their money to Planned Parenthood or, or, or for you so-called black women to get abortions. They didn't want their money going towards any, that money couldn't be used towards no other race except for you. These people have set up, uh, uh, hey look, 
Ooh, man. It's all Yahweh Bashim Yahweh Shido, man. We are under the curses of Deuteronomy chapter 28. But man, boy, I tell you, boy, is this. Boy, this is why the scripture says that the, 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 the saints are patiently and faithfully waiting, man. We're, uh, we, I can't, I, I pray. Oh my goodness, I pray, man. I'm a part of, 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 of the, the, the 144,000 elect, man. The chosen. I pray, man, so I can be a part of the, the, the whoop down, man. The whoop down of the enemy. I, I, I pray, man. So with that, I pray that the lesson was edifying. Kwame Ashala. This ought to have you completely heated, man.